I'm more presentable today. I ain't coming here with my little twisties and my hair all frizzy so you can see my gray hairs. You can't see my gray hairs today. You can't see them. Let me fix my wig. Let me fix my wig. Um, but yeah, I'm working from home today. And oh, I got some I got some goodies that I ordered that I want to share with you guys. And then I also got an unboxing. Yes, it's a wig. <laughs> oh, and then I also ordered some stuff from Mommy. I'm excited to show y'all this too. So, y'all have some goodies. Put this up. So yeah, we're going to do that this evening. Right now, I'm just on my lunch break, and that's about it. So I'll holler at y'all when I get off tonight, and that way I can go through the goodies I have. Okay, right, guys, we're doing a bar crawl tonight in the Midwood area. moment Felix yes. and you have to let the world Pick know up. Look <laughs> you gotta represent this household now. <laughs> okay Felix tell us about this what is this a beer bar crawl bar crawl, bar crawl. Bar crawl. So it was spooky Halloween crawl there's seven spots we visited one so far had some beers tried to have a pretzel but it messed up <laughs> We're at a pizza place. Okay, in... you're not following directions. Yes, he is. Don't do it like that. You do it, then. <laughs> Come on, then. Guided tour. <laughs> Come on, guided tour. <laughs> We're at Pizza Peel doing Hocus Pocus, which is rum, blue carousel, sour apple, pineapple juice, and Sprite. And we're getting slices of pizza. Yes, and we get this for free. Except for the drink. The drink is $10. <laughs> this is a slice for my niece. <laughs> ah, Layla would be like, um, <laughs> right? Give me a whole slice. Well, I mean, you could have gave me a regular slice and a drink. The drink could have been six, seven, and then the slice could have been a dollar, two dollars. What it costs in New York? It's our hocus pocus drink. Yes. All right, guys. So we are at this one place. I can't. I don't know. I can't see that. Y'all know my eyes is just not good. And we got the fried chicken sandwich. And then we got this slushy drink that has like rosé. Ooh. I might have to get another one. That's good. Those are cute, Chelsea. Right? Look at these too. These are 
It's like the silver one. Thirteen. Felix, this is good. I'll sneak up on two. This is twelve for those. Oh, they got records. My hands are full. I can't go through them. I know it's been a minute, guys. Um, we're about to head to Costco's right now. When I get back to the house, I have several unboxings <laughs> to um, share with you guys. I'm behind on one of the boxes that I got but um yeah we're gonna go run to Costco so we can grab some stuff and I'll see you guys when we get there and then back at the house so that way I can show you my unboxings that I have there's so many people in Costco's and I in Costco because I know Everyone's trying to pick up stuff for Thanksgiving, but we're not picking up anything for Thanksgiving. They have these really good garlic wings and I wanted some. And their rotisserie chickens are so good. Oh my God, they're so yummy. I'm waiting for those wings right there. Look at that. Whew, y'all, it's a madhouse in there. I started, we both started having anxiety. <laughs> we had to get the fuck out of there. Fix my language. Mm -mm. Time to go. All right, so. We got what we needed. We got our, it's like a garlic chicken wings. They are so good. <laughs> That's what we're gonna have today for um dinner. This boy. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you when we get back to the house. Okay guys, so I wanna show you guys the chicken wings that we that I get from, I was about to say Publix, <laughs> from Costco's. We get these and they're so good. But what I do is when I, they're cooked, I just like to put them in the air fryer because I don't like my chicken, I don't like my skin to not have a crisp to it. So I put our chicken wings back in the air fryer. So those are the wings. I, you know, <laughs> your girl had to taste one. Um, but yes, these are the wings and they are so good. They're from Costco's. And it's like right in the area where they have the, um, the rotisserie chickens. So, see, my skin just gotta have a little crunch to it. Yeah. And we just gonna have some salad. Today was a lazy Sunday. Like I was not feeling it, but y'all know my normal. I wash, I do laundry, wash clothes. Well, that's the same thing. I do laundry, wash the bedding and everything on the bed. So I'm waiting for the babe to come back. He went to go fill up the cars um, for this week and we'll put the, sheets and stuff back on the bed so um but yeah i'm actually about to go in here and take this stuff out the dryer The 
washer and the dryer. But I hope all this stuff is. Mmm, I love the way Gain smells. Like I, I can't use anything else on my sheets. Nothing else. Like that's it. Mm. And they be nice and warm. As a kid, I used to take all the stuff out of the dryer, throw it on the bed, and then I throw myself on the bed. My mother used to be like, oh, throw the stuff out, throw the stuff out. <laughs> So yeah, I use this game. Oh, actually, let me show you guys what we put on our clothes. Hold on. Like we didn't used to do this, but because of, since COVID, we bought, Get this OxyClean. If I can get it off my little rack, it's um OxyClean sanitizer. This is really good. Like I put a scoop of this. I don't even fill it up. I probably do like there's a line right here, and then there's a line right there. I put it in the middle. Um. Yeah, I use this. For the sheets towels um i even wash our masks like i put all of our mask in like hot water in the sink and put um like where the one is at the bottom of the little cup holder i fill it there dump that in there, and i let all our masks sit in there just all the dirt and stuff be pulling out um and then i use this too for like our stuff when we go to the gym, the Lysol laundry sanitizer, this is really good too. Cause like, especially for workout stuff, um, has like, it's good for like sports sweat. So, and my favorite fabric softener, sheets, and I use the liquid, and I use the unstoppable beads. Your girl stuff be soft and it be smelling so good for so long. And I found this too at, um, Walmart so I haven't plugged in they smell really good um yeah and I even have the spray I think it was Febreze had like a cranberry crisp spray so I bought that so yeah it smells really fallish autumnish in the house but Bath and Body Works has this one called I don't know if it's ba balsam or sweater weather balsam fresh but it smells like winter like a Christmas tree and I want that in the house for when I put my tree up so I'm waiting for them to put their candles on sale talk about like four and like two in the living room and the house could just smell like Christmas <laughs> I love Christmas my sister gave me this comforter I love this comforter mm, it's wet though <laughs> alright let me put my fabric off there in here well sheets they're good for static and it makes your clothes like soft tearing up stuff and I swift I steamed the floors today the um bathroom floors kitchen floor which is bleach and a little drop of fabuloso but you know me I like me some bleach so but that's about it y'all I'm about to Make this little, our little Caesar salad stuff. And we're about to eat. Oh, well, after I eat, I will come back to y'all. Show y'all what I got. 
because I got to eat something. It's four o'clock already. So, and I haven't eaten anything today but a bowl of cereal. That's still eating, but that's not enough. Um, I've just been cleaning and doing house chores and yeah. So yeah, and we're going to watch the football game. So then I'll come back to you guys and let y'all know about all the stuff that you missed out on. I'm obsessed with my my sheets. I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> All right, guys. So I had a couple of unboxings that I needed to do. And one of them is from Chanel. You can't really see it, but yeah. So here is my package. Somebody's in there tearing up the dishes while he's doing the dishes, but don't mind him. So, I got my receipts are in here. Yeah, the receipts are in there. So, let's see. All right, let's move this out the way. I'm always like so. Y'all listen, like I can't even remember what I ordered, to be honest with you. Oh, these are the samples. So they always allow you to pick some samples um, after you make a purchase. So that was one of them. Okay, so this was one of the... Um, this is what they gave me. So they want you to kind of like get some information on the facial serum. So I'm excited to use this. I feel like it was something else. Oh yeah, so it was this too. And then perfume. I'm excited to try that. Mm -hmm. mm. And I love that they give you these little bags too because I can put my perfume bottles in them. So I'm excited about those for when I'm traveling. So, oh, okay guys, I do remember what I got. Because I'm so obsessed with Coco Mademoiselle, I got the actual bath soap so this I'm excited to use and then I got the body cream so I'm a true believer of when you put on your perfume if you put the body cream or the lotion on you just have to do a dab or a spray or two of the perfume and it helps hold the scent longer so I'm excited for this yay so we got just those two, some samples, and they make the bag, the box look so pretty. I do love keeping the boxes because I have like a lot of nail polishes and stuff. So I do um, store stuff inside these boxes. And they're like good decor too, just to like put up and sit up on the shelf. So eventually when I get that bookshelf, in that corner over there I can um, sit these boxes in there but that's that okay and I've also been obsessed with the Lumi collection so I got the cotton the clean cotton whole body deodorant wipes so they say this is for your feet for your feet <laughs> For your feet your private areas in the armpits so yeah um, i've tried a, a couple of them already i do like it for work for like when that time of the month comes and you want to have like a little um refresher wipes with you i really do love like carrying stuff like this in my purse and i have like a little bag that i keep on my desk at work for just those times you know so you with a lot of goodies in it 
I also got the Coconut Crush Whole Body Deodorant. And this is as well for your privates, your feet, and the armpits. So, oh, Lord. I said I wanted to try this. Definitely, I don't know how I feel about my underarms smelling like coconut. I'm more of a shower powder fresh scent. That's just what I like. Um, but I definitely would, I'm definitely going to try it just to see if it actually like holds you out. And it's saying it's good for 72 hour odor control. So that's the Lumi. And you guys know like over the summer, I've tried the, what was it? It was the shower gel. And there was some other things that I've tried with them. So, and I really, 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 really loved it. Um, and then I also got the Clean Tangerine as well. So, yeah. So, I'm excited to try these. 72-hour uh, odor control as well for your pits, the feet, and private. So, that was it. And when we went to D.C., I did tell you guys I had a unboxing for Eunice hair so I will put clips in of the wig the wig was beautiful when I tell you the only thing I probably needed to do was like you know pluck a little bit here and there the lace never matches with me and these this is actually one of the wigs that I made myself when I have like on my downtime I make my wigs myself so this one here I made myself but the one that I'll put a clip in for you guys to see um the hair and how well it curled we went out to dinner um when we went to dc for babe's birthday so yeah that's pretty much it for what i had oh no i'm so lying i have one more box <laughs> hold on i got So I also got, um, I want to say the name of the body, it's like shower gels, lotions, and it's called Natrium, and their products I've been wanting to try for the longest. So hold on, I'm going to have to go get some scissors so we can cut this open. time I get really um, like dry skin and I just feel like our water here in North Carolina is just really hard this here guys I decided to try this and I got the it's a facial cleanser so it's supposed to gently cleanse and exfoliate and soothe the face so I'm I'm excited to try this I've seen a lot of people on YouTube trying it out and then this one is the the glow getter multi-oil body wash I wanted to try this just like I told you guys. I have really dry skin. And I really feel like it's because our water is so hard here in North Carolina. So I'm excited to do this as well. So from oil to gel. And it's supposed to neutralize. Like nourish and neutralize, moisturize the skin. So I'm excited to use this. And... This is the Brightener Vitamin C Body Wash. So this gently cleanses, exfoliates, and brightens for a radiant looking skin. So who don't wanna look refreshed and glowing and stuff? So I wanted to, got this one to try. 
one more. What's this? So this is the, this is a body wash as well. So this is supposed to soothe, softens, renews for more even looking skin. So it's supposed to kind of help you get more of an even skin tone on your skin. So I'm excited to try this as well. So those are my four items that I got. Okay. I have one for my face. Ah! So I'm excited. So that is actually it. That's all I have. Like I promise. <laughs> That's it for unboxing. And once I actually try them, maybe I can do like a get ready with me um, in the shower just so we can see how everything feels with using the items. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm always excited to like try new body stuff because all i all i use is like dove um it's like this really big dove i have a really big yeah this is what i shower with so i'm i'm excited to try some other things to see if it's going to help with moisturizing and adding the nutrients to my skin from this dry water that we have here so that is it for tonight um the wings came out really good laundry's done comforter is still in there drying though um it stopped but i haven't even checked it yet <laughs> so i definitely need to go put my um comforter on the bed and put those pictures in so I'm hoping you guys like the you nice wig, you nice, you nice, however you say it, wig. Oh, and I actually curled the hair with flexi rods in the video too. When you guys see the clip from DC, so I use flexi rods, um, and I just use the barrel like up here at the top to like flatten it out. Um, but yeah, the the wig came pretty much ready to go um i'll probably just tweak tweeze it a little bit just to add to it but i I, re I just wear a middle part i don't do nothing else to my like wigs or anything i don't do baby hairs or nothing like that that's just not my thing so i like i just like for it to look as natural as possible so that's gonna be it for today i will get back with you guys and go from there. All right, guys. So this is the Eunice wig. I want to say I got 22 inches. And it comes right to my walls. Yeah. I literally didn't do, I just took it out the, I keep it in a satin bag. So I just wanted you guys to see it. Love it, it's nice and soft, very flat. Like, it's very flat. And you, as you can see, still some of the wand curls are still in it from when I curled my hair with the, um, flexi rods <laughs> so yeah you'll have the clip from when I wear this wig in DC as I stated um yeah very minimal to do with it I probably will go in and um maybe like pluck a little bit more but when I wear it again I'll like flatten it and I can do like a because it's a Got a five by five, so I can part it on this side, I can part it on that side. I like it a lot. Really soft. I like, I don't think I felt, I don't think there was really no shedding. 
that's just one literally just one strand from doing that one strand from doing that so a total of two so that's it yeah and this is the wig all right so i have my other wig back on now and i'm getting ready for bed pretty much so this is how i flexi rod i put one one and then two on the side and that's it um all right so now i have my bonnet on and i'm about to use my pons makeup remover wipes Yo, that liquid, my liquid eyeliner do not be want to come off. I be forgetting sometimes I have it on at work and I like rub my eye and it still be there. <laughs> I actually, this is what I use. It's Sephora. It's really good. I also use um, a little bit of brightener underneath my eyes. This one is the Bright Fix in Honey. I use this. Literally, I just do one, two, three, one, two, three, and that's it. And that's it. And that's it. This is like a little pea size. It says supply a generous amount onto damp skin and massage it. Rinse thoroughly. So you're supposed to go up. It feels really clean. The exfoliating 
part felt really good. Hmm. So yeah, I use this. And now I'm just gonna wet. <laughs> I'll do that next weekend. Bye, clean face before I go chill in the living room for a little bit. What? <laughs>